can't see me at all. I know. Hi! Buenos noches! We just got back from the movie. an interesting evening with Lindsay and her boyfriend Justin, who is interesting. Yeah, um, he, he's a player, and, like, he likes it on Hillary a lot, and I'm um, surprised he wasn't, like, play-playing the night, because he really likes it on other people, and we don't want to tell Lindsay because she would get very upset. Yep. So, we're not going to tell her for a while. Lost my new phone. Check it. It's pretty sweet. Slide it. Oh, slide it. Hey. Hey. Yeah. Bling, bling. It's got a pretty green color on the side. Yes, it's blue. Oh, whatever. It's like a blue green. <laughs> it's a Samsung phone. So, Larry's phone charger matches my phone charger, which is kind of cool. I was making sure it was still playing. Yeah. It's going to keep playing because that's flashing up there. Oh. That means it's playing a video. I had a cupcake earlier. They're actually pretty delicious cupcakes. She like. showed me her cupcake when I was brushing my teeth, so I couldn't have a cupcake. Yeah, I got to brush my teeth, too. And because I got to go to the dentist tomorrow, and they're going to, like, clean my teeth and hopefully not drill anything in my mouth because I don't like to drill. And, um... Well, her dentist appointment is on... It's tomorrow. Tomorrow, and four. And then Hillary's... What ortho? Orthodontist appointment is on Thursday. At 9 a.m. So we got to get up way early. So Hillary, depending on what her mom says, Hillary's just going to hang out with me through this week because we don't have a job. No, today was our last day at work. So we are jobless, and now we can hang out all the time before we get a job. <laughs> yeah, be bummed. <laughs> We're going to be bummed until we find a new job, which in today's economy is not going to be easy because the economy sucks freaking balls. God, my hand hurts. Her hand hurts. I'll hold it for a little while. Okay. Well, her hand hurts, so, yeah. But, um, I don't know. Oh, and that piñata right there in my room is Ariel. And Hillary got it in Mexico when she went with the faggot ass boy that is a big douchebag. And if I ever see him, I'm going to, like, hurt him very speaking, bad. Speaking of, his really oh, gay friend, God. Jose keeps talking to me, and um, apparently it's not clicking in his head that I want nothing to do with anyone that reminds me of the fag. Yeah. So he's all like, blah de blah own my pictures on my yearbook. And we're like, no, dude, like, back the hell off, you know. You're ugly. You, you broke my, your friend broke my friend's heart, and now you want to be like, talk to me? Like, hell no. No, I don't want to talk to you. So... I don't know, like, I think he's just another big douchebag. He is, because I've met him a couple times, because he's one of my ex faggots best friends. Oh, and his status says in a relationship. Yeah, it does, so he's telling me that he's great and he's cute and stuff, for the reasons why I should buy his pictures, but... I think it stopped recording. No, it didn't. <laughs> being the reasons why I should buy his pictures is that he's cute and stuff, but it says he's in a relationship. Which is really freaking crappy. Like, that's so crappy. And, yeah, it's just kind of crazy. Like, our life is pretty crazy. Oh, my mom wants to move to New Mexico. And I told her I wasn't going to move because, no offense to any New Mexicans who watch <laughs> our videos, because I'm pretty sure we're not, like, super freaking hella popular on YouTube because we're both not, like, skinny, anorexic, freaking awesomely beautiful bitches. Not that we're not cute because we are cute. We just aren't like, like, <laughs> I don't know, a lot of people don't want, are probably not watching all this video, but if any New Mexicans do, it's like total no offense to you at all, but it's really fucking cold, and it, uh, I don't think I want to leave, because I just started dating my boyfriend, and I don't want to leave him, so, and like, I couldn't leave my friends, like, I would die without Hillary, like, Hillary went to New Mexico with me, but I'm pretty sure that if she and Caleb weren't there, you know, especially Hillary, if she wasn't there, I probably would die. Like, face first, fall off of the truck in the snow, face first, because I hate <laughs> Mexico that much without my friends and my boyfriend. But my boyfriend and I just started dating, so I don't love him. But I think I really like him a lot. 